Steve, uh, this Saturday we've got a big show in conjunction with Sporty Stuff TV. Uh, we're going live on there at 10 o'clock, but prior to that we're going live for the first time in a long time on VIP Boxing as well. Yeah, on our YouTube channel from 7 o'clock till 10 o'clock we'll have uh, the undercard which will be eight fights and they're not bad fights. We've had a load of changes in the last couple of days. It's been uh, been been tough, but where we stood at the moment and it's... Uh, Half past five on Wednesday, we've got 10 out of 11 max and we, we're pretty confident that we'll get the, the last one max as well. So at um, uh, 10 o'clock, um, it's going to be Roman Fiora at, um, let's say, half past 10 it'll be Reese Mole and then at 11 o'clock it's, it's Saheed as I say. So, um, Which is an English super battleweight title. That's right, yeah. And um, they fought before, had a, had a very close fight as uh, he'd lost by a point. Um, looking forward to that. And it'd be good for the viewers. So it's on uh, Sky Channel 437, it's on uh, 3 View 264, and 3 Sat 250. So it's available into 12 million homes and it's free. Anyone can tune in. And obviously we're hearing the rumours about Conor Ben and Eubank possibly being off. Um, don't want to speak too much about that because I don't know the ins and outs of it all. But uh, if it's true that Conor Ben's failed a drug test, I believe, and I'm not really a lover of the boxing board of control, I think the board have made the right decision there and told them that he can't go ahead. Rumours are that they're challenging in that in, in, in the court of law and also looking for maybe another governing body to do it but really it doesn't affect ours we're going ahead hopefully people will get in and view it live and free and it'd be a great show well, that's it it's important thing. it's live and it's free so, that, um, that's it and like starting off we've got jamie mellers he's had like three opponents the last couple of days but seamus devlin who you can rely time. on um he's turning up and He's improving, I know he, he's not won in all the fights he's had, but... Uh, well, he has, he's actually had one win and a draw. Oh, that's his I didn't realise he had a win, yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's his 40 second fight in the space of 14 months, so that's yeah, phenomenal. Yeah, right? so listen, he, he always pushes him and uh, that would be a good, good opener yeah. for us, really. And then we've got uh, Bradley Cousins v Louis Van Pooch, and Again. Pooch is on the roll now. I believe yeah. it's his last year and he's going to be sorely missed, isn't he? But uh, he comes and tests everybody. Um, Josh Hargreaves, um, again, last minute change of opponent. He's fighting that Jay Cosgood, who's a little bit bigger than him, but um, you know, he's, he's a quality kid, Josh. And he's he's used to that right? present, yeah. isn't he? Everybody's had his fault, he's mm. a bit bigger than him. Yeah, Louis Booth, we've had five opponents in the last five days, and, and, and we've just lost one again, so um, we're out on the lookout for him. But we'll, we'll get someone, I'm confident in him. Sonny Taylor, three opponents in the last four days, but uh, we've managed to uh, get Ozzy Jervis from London, which will be a good test for Sonny. Levi Smith's got the ever dependable Jamie Quinn. Jake Goodwin, Sir Jan Pompo, who's upset one of our kids. Just got a knockout. Two weeks sure, and not he? there. So, you know, Jake's going to have to um, be a bit more careful in his, with his defence than he normally is. So that's a, a good fight. Probably. Well, I'm not as fair to say fight the night, but it's a grudge match, Jake Gray and Owen Kirk. Um, Definitely, yeah. That's going to be a belt, so. I didn't realise, you know, it's not only Owen Kirk's first six rounder, but it's Jake Gray's first six rounder. Yeah, so he, was, he was telling me that the other day, yeah. So, uh, you know, Owen thinks he was uh, robbed in the last one and he injured his hand and thinks he can do a lot better. Jake Gray doesn't think it was a fluke and. Uh, you know, they're both saying they're going to stop each other, so know, it's going to what be does that mean? It means <laughs> there's going to be a belt to done it, so uh, that's now about 9.35. Well, the first one live on Sky 437, sporty stuff. Roman Fury's debut against Ryan Hibbert. Reese Mould, three opponents in, in the last seven days, but we've got Jordan Ellison now, who's just stepped in last right. minute, and you know what? We should have got him at the start, shouldn't we? Because yeah. um, he, he he's perfect for him to, to move up to lightweight and uh, have, a, have a test. Well, uh, didn't he win the lightweight's Northern Area title only a, a few months ago against 
A kid who was eight and old, uh, Teddy Wilkins. Yeah, I think, I think he's was. lost it since, but yeah. uh, he gave a uh, kid in all uh, Louis Sylvester a yes, great he fight, didn't he? And, uh, and then one we mentioned before, the top of the bill, uh, be about 11 10, uh, Saheed Hussein against Razik Nadjab. And uh, that's a little grudge match as well, you know. And um, none of them are, are going to be able to walk around in the local areas and they get beat. <laughs> so. Uh, you know, I'm really pleased with the card. We've had awful, awful problems with it, but it's nothing new, is it? So, no, uh, I'm really pleased that we've delivered the Sporty Stuff TV, and it is a trial one, so uh, if this all goes well, um, we should be doing some more of them, but let, let's see what happens. I mean, the only other thing to say is that you can bet on these as well, so uh, I think William Hill have already put uh, Prices out for Zahi the same and Razid Nadjab. That must be the first time for a long time on, on our shows, is it? Yeah? Um, never been done before that, the Brilliant. Brilliant. Yeah. Brilliant. Right, well, yeah. I'm looking forward to it. I know we're getting out there early because we're going to film all the way ins on the day and uh, look forward to uh, everyone tuning in. Yeah, like small all shows it is best, mate. So uh, let's make sure that we uh, put a good advert out for the, uh, the sport of boxing, mate. Alright, that's from Steve. Thank see you. On, see you on Friday and Saturday. Cheers. For all boxing, info, news, and latest interviews, amateur and pro across the north, click and subscribe. VIP boxing promotions. Also, Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook.